So Brandon brought a microphone as, with him as well, and it's common to see beatboxers up there working the microphone. Is right. there a specific right. microphone that you like to use for, for beatboxing? Uh, I personally, at the moment, I'm using an uh, AKG model D5 microphone, which is a very common microphone for uh, many beatboxers uh, due to its um, uh, frequency response and uh, the ability to uh, use proximity effect where you actually as you get closer to the microphone uh, bass frequencies increase which is a very good thing for beatboxing um, as far as microphone technique uh, this is a case where it is preferable to have your mouth as close to the microphone as possible to achieve some of the more bassy frequencies so uh, from the side view here, uh, I would generally hold the microphone something like this. Uh, rather than down by the handle, it's helpful to actually hold it from the uh, uh, actual grill of the microphone to uh, be able to sort of um, uh, focus in more specifically and directly, directly in front of your face rather than having it down here. Mm -hmm. It's very important to have the microphone as close to the source of sound as possible. So if I'm beatboxing, I will often have it much closer, something like this, if not actually having my lips touching the uh, microphone. So uh, to beatbox a microphone would sound more like Some beatboxers use sort of a slightly upward um, uh, angle of holding the microphone, which basically achieves the same purpose. It's just more comfortable for some people. Um, as far as holding a harmonica and doing this at the same time, uh, I would actually hold the harmonica in standard grip while holding the microphone, um, usually using like the bottom two fingers of my hand, um, having the top three fingers, uh, top two fingers and thumb um, free for actually cupping the um, um, harmonica. Um, this is a style where you will not generally cup with two hands uh, because you actually need the microphone free to beatbox through. Uh, it is, of course, uh, if I'm doing a heart boxing routine, I will be beatboxing through the harmonica and the microphone, so the sound will actually move through the harmonica. Um, this is actually very helpful uh, in terms of the harmonica actually amplifying the beat frequencies. Uh, so, uh, as I was saying before, beatboxing directly through the microphone would sound like this. If I do the same thing pretty much through the harmonica, uh, it can be amplified in certain contexts to where the reed movement adds a lot of extra sound to the beat, for instance. So as you can see, actually beatboxing through the harmonica even makes the tone much louder and much more distinct and precise. Uh, if I am wanting to play the harmonica and interlude that while beatboxing directly through the microphone, I use a technique of basically raising the harmonica slightly uh, while still gripping the microphone with my bottom two or three fingers and actually bringing the microphone up to my face like that so that um, the um, harmonica itself is somewhat vertical with my nose and I can still speak or beatbox through the harmonica so uh, say if I'm playing a phrase <laughs> still want to sing through the microphone, I can simply lift the harmonica using my thumb and uh, forefinger and uh, having the actual end of the microphone, the grill portion of the microphone exposed to still beatbox and speak through, so on and so forth like this. So I can still create beats and switch back to playing the harmonica by a simple movement up and down of my fingers.